Big news in the National Football League yesterday that the longtime embarrassment that was Daniel Snyder as the owner of the Washington Commanders is coming to an end. He agreed to sell the team to a group led by 76ers owner Josh Harris and includes basketball legend Magic Johnson for $6 billion. Snyder owned the once proud franchise for 24 years and piece by piece drained the fan base. The product on the field less than championship level. They won just two playoff games. He started charging fans to attend training camp in 2000. Every coach he hired left without a winning record. But much worse, the organization was stained by harassment scandals, which led to Snyder quitting day to day operations July of 21 after an NFL investigation and being fined $10 million. He vowed for years never to change the original team's name until the public and corporate pressure was too much. The NFL hired Mary Jo White, former U.S. attorney and SEC chair, to investigate financial allegations of misconduct by Snyder. That report has yet to be released. He could not get political or corporate support to build a new stadium. Their stadium right now, FedEx Field, is an absolute dump. Snyder grew up a huge fan of Washington and will leave the NFL as one of the great embarrassments that have ever owned a professional sports franchise in this country. He was a disgrace. Congrats to the NFL and all Commanders fans out there. Your long nightmare is almost over. Until next time, New York, I'm Mark Malusis.